Well, hello everybody, it's Spectacular, and how are you? I am going to show you the new Pac-Man coins. They're new to me. I mean, they've been out now for a couple weeks. Uh, they were on pre-order. I think they still might be, but they're starting to ship out now. You're going to start seeing these in the community a little bit. I think they're really fun. I'm going to show you a few different types that I picked up, and just for fun, we're going to play Pac-Man. No, this is not the one your grandma played. This, well, or your mom, or maybe yourself, but this is actually a new Pac-Man because it was free just for the sake of this video and just for fun. So, uh, for some people, what is Pac-Man? Well, I don't know. It's just like one of the biggest video games of all time. No joke. It's in like the top 10 list of biggest games there have, has ever been. It's kind of crazy. Uh, number one, believe it or not, being Minecraft. So if you ever heard of those games, Minecraft and Pac-Man, um, you're missing out, I guess. I don't know. You're just, you're under a rock of video games. But um, yeah, man, this is a cool little coin. And I got a few different kinds here. I'll start with this right here. This is just the, let's see, uh, 2020 Nue one ounce silver, $2 Pac-Man 40th anniversary coin. And it is a coin and it is Pac-Man. There's Pac-Man. There's, what are those little ghosts called? I, I don't even know. Uh, Blimpy, Blompy, blah, 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 blah. I don't know. Maybe they all have different names depending on the color of them. I'm not sure. Um, I liked Pac-Man to some degree but I could not get into it that much. Uh, my mother used to tell me a story about how she was pregnant with me and would play Pac-Man nonstop. So that's how old this game is. It's ancient. It's an ancient video game, but um, it's pretty cool. Now these right here run about 30 or so dollars uh, right on the edge. It's actually a really nice side right here. Let me show you this. Hold on. That's really pretty. And yeah, it's got, it's got Pac-Man and all the little ghosts and stuff going around the around the edge there and it's it's really well presented it's it's well done now unfortunately the limit on these is about twenty five thousand, so it's kind of on the slightly higher end but still if you like pac-man this would be a coin for you i believe i don't imagine you're going to be able to flip this one in particular too well now there is a proof version which i did not get uh doing very well in the secondary market there's also a gold um, not doing that great in my opinion there's also this one right here the colorized one I don't like colorized silver, not a fan, but I seen an opportunity because they had a limited amount of these and I went ahead and grabbed a couple. Uh, and actually they're doing very well again on the secondary market, about double their price. So if you could have found these, let me zoom in a little bit. If you could have found these, I think you were doing well, but here is um, the backside, the reverse, and uh, you'll see no colorization here. But the little holder, of course, has you know everything you need that's colorized. Kind of, kind of cute. I don't know. You're paying extra for that for sure, and then you're paying extra for the colorized front. So there is that. Again, not a big, huge fan of colorized silver, but they will resell pretty well. So worst case scenarios, I can make some money for some more silver. And I got a few, well, a couple of those rather. Let's just say a couple. Got a couple of those because I wasn't really 100% on these. Um, but I am happy to have them. They are kind of cool. I also got uh, five of the ones that are not colorized in these little holders, and they weren't hardly any more money for the little holders. And I think the holders actually add a lot of pizzazz to them. So here's the regular BU and just plastic, no big deal. And here is the one in the holder. So again, in my opinion, the holder just adds a little bit of coolness to it. And it's plastic, no big deal, but... Um, yeah, definitely keep those in the holder if you got them. Uh, if you bought a pack of 20 of the regular BU, then you could get it into a sealed uh, little uh, tube. And the tube had like a sticker on it that uh, was Pac-Man related. So it was cute. Um, you know, I like games. I like playing games. It kind of gets my mind off of the craziness of the world. And uh, in 2020, it's been very helpful to get my mind elsewhere. You know, just getting into some games once in a while. And same thing as a movie, really, except for just playing it, you know. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, I, I do like these a lot. I think that they're, I think they're fun. And I hope they start doing more uh, game-related things because, like I said, it just it helps my mind get off of the real world. And I do enjoy my games once in a while. And I think a lot of people do, too. You know, games aren't just for little kids anymore. A lot of adults play games. Uh, give it a try. Maybe you'll be, you know, be interested in it. 
Maybe you don't have the time, I don't know. But <clears throat> just for fun, I'm gonna play this Pac-Man game because how much can I talk about Pac-Man coins? They're cool, for sure. Um, get the colorized if they're still available anywhere. I don't think they are. These were on AppMex. And uh, you know, I think you're gonna be fine that these right here on AppMex are sold out completely. And um, you know, it is what it is. Sorry about your luck. Um, these may, if they end up getting completely sold out, these may go up a, a few dollars in the future, but I don't see them being too crazy valuable. It's not that kind of crazy of a flip. Uh, definitely more of a collector's item. I don't imagine you'd sell them for less than you bought them for, but I don't see you making a gigantic profit either. Anyways, uh, let's get to this right here. This just happens to be some kind of free version of, um, what's this called again? Pac-Man. <laughs> free version of Pac-Man. We're going to try it out just for fun. I think the arrows are probably the only thing I use on the keyboard, hopefully, because, um, okay, difficulty beginner. What's my choices? That's my choices. No, normal. Let's go to normal. Game speed goes from one to 10 on normal. Yes, let's up the ante. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna confirm that. We're gonna start it, start. Okay, let's see, what are my controls here? I can use a bomb now. This is new, this is, this is new to Pac-Man, using bombs, this is not normal. Well, let me move these over right here so we can get some sound in here. Move my Pac-Man coins, which are going everywhere. Oh, I'm scared. I'm a little scared. All right, so uh, I have choices. I can either use arrows or WASD. Let's use WASD in the space bomb, uh, space for the bombs. Okay, so I'm kind of curious what the bomb is. Oh, it tells you right here. Use bombs when you think you're in danger. That's great. Okay, I don't have time to read that. People are, okay, here we go. Um, who am I? I'm Pac-Man. That's right. Okay, I'm down here. And this is not, this is not, the thing's chasing me. This is not the old Pac-Man. It's really coming after me now. There's cherries. Okay. There's more, more ghosts. Jeez, this is psychedelic. I'm sorry if anybody has epileptic seizures, but this right here could trigger it. Please look away if you do have epileptic seizures. What did I do? Just, okay. Where's my bomb at? It was, should I use a bomb now? I feel like I'm doing okay without this bomb situation. I should have been on beginner. This is going a little fast now. And that's what happens with Pac-Man. You start getting real cocky, start going, oh, these things aren't chasing me. And then they start going different directions. All right, should I eat these guys now? Yes, I eat them. Look at me eating them. Come back here. Okay, then they start turning colors on you though. And then you get to the point where it's a little too close for comfort. And then you eat a ghost that's not edible and then you die. But not in that case. In that case, I won. This is tripping me out right now. Oh, Josh, what'd I do? Oh, geez, ha, ha. Did he just stop? I feel like he was going to eat me, and he stopped. Oh, oh, wow, wow, okay. Getting intense. Hopefully this is not going to last too much longer. I got three minutes of this left. Can I do it? Can I win the game? Game speed is 16. Why is it going up? It should go down. Why are they sleeping? I feel like the, there's no instruction booklet for this thing. There's one little thing right there. Get out of there. There should have been more instructions, okay? We're going for the bananas, because that's important if you're... If you got ghosts chasing after you, you have to have bananas. I'm going to need a bomb. I need a bomb. Hey, ha, 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 the bomb worked. Do you see that? That's what bombs do. The bombs make you blow things up. Just like a real bomb, I guess. So these guys are sleeping. Don't wake them. Whatever you do. Why is the game turning dark? That's the end of the demo. It wants me to buy it. I'm not going to do it. It was just fun real quick for the sake of this. Anyways, uh, so yeah, consider. I think there's still some available. Some of these right here in the little holders on AppMax. So... Uh, whoa, I just dropped one. Consider these right here. If you like games, if you think it's cute, I bet you anything. You know somebody in your family that likes Pac-Man or has played Pac-Man and is a fan of, you know, the old Pac-Man games. I bet you have a story about Pac-Man. In fact, if you do have a story about Pac-Man, because everybody does, because it's one of the biggest games of all time. No joke. I'm not making that up. Look at the internet. Uh, you just go ahead and put it in the comment. Tell me a little story about Pac-Man. Yeah, I played it. Yeah, I didn't play it. Uh, I think games are for sissies. Uh, or uh, men in tights. I don't know. Uh, but either way, I, I want to hear some kind of Pac-Man related story. Um, anyways, uh, more content coming up in the future for sure. Some stuff you're really going to like. I guarantee it. In fact, I got to work with somebody that you all like very soon to make some really nice content for you all. I got to go for now. Buy the Pac-Man coins if you like. If you don't like them, then you know you don't like Pac-Man. What can I say? Just be a grump. It's fine. Spectacular is Pac-Man out. <laughs>